There are many crowns in heaven. Many crowns. Many crowns for many things. There is a crown of salvation for those who just accept Jesus. They believe in him and they die. They get to heaven. And they have a crown. It's just just a crown that Jesus paid everything for. And they get to put it on their head. They didn't do anything with their salvation. They just believed in Jesus. They lived their whole life unsurrendered. They did whatever they want. They married who they wanted. They had the career that they had. They wanted. They did whatever they wanted. Mm. Get their crown. Mm. Then there's others who say, Jesus, I want to surrender everything to you. Mm. All my heart. All my life. I give it to you. You make every decision for me. Your dreams are my dreams. Your plans are my plans. Your thoughts are my thoughts. Your ways are my ways. doesn't matter what it costs me. It doesn't matter what I give up because I never give anything up. But I get so much. Hmm. Everything for the kingdom of God. I seek first the kingdom of God and his righteousness. I'll lay it all down for you. And God says, oh really? You want to do that? And you'll be tested. And with every test, you die a little bit more. And there's there's a a jewel put in that crown. You die a little bit more, a jewel put in the crown. You obey him. A big death to self. Another jewel put in the crown. The crown of the faithful. The crown of those who are persecuted. The crown of those who walk through fire. The crown of those who laid down everything. Who laid down everything for Jesus. And continue to. Who learned how to talk different. Who learned how to walk different. Who learned how to quiet their mouth. And say only what God said. Who learned the government. Who learned authority. Who learned anointing. Who cherished it. Who became mature adults. Carrying multiple weapons. In charge of platoons of soldiers. Took took authority over their domain. Not a demon on their property. Not a demon left. Didn't have any back door open to the devil. Nothing. Mm -hmm. Nothing. They trusted God. And they get to heaven. And there's their crown. And it's big. It's huge. And it's filled with these jewels. Jesus says, there's your crown. And the, and the guy with the little crown goes, wow, why did he get all that? Because he fought the good fight. He kept the faith. She finished her race. She finished her course. She let me get all the demons out of her. She let me get all the junk out of her. She continually lived surrendered without excuse. Thank you, she obeyed me. She obeyed me to the very end. Scripture says we will lay our crowns at his feet. You want to give him back the very same crown he gave you with no jewels? Well, here's a salvation crown. I didn't do much. Here's at your feet. Here comes the other one. Oh, Lord, I'm so glad I could give you everything. This, I didn't know this was going to represent my life. Like, I didn't know that. Like, this was going to represent all my life of obedience and surrender to you oh, and, and, and humility and learning how to talk different and walk different and think different and act different and trust you in everything. And now I get to lay this big blessing at your feet. Oh, Jesus! I didn't know that's what I was going to hear with it too. Oh, man. He says, well done. Well done. You're in charge of many cities. Wow. You're in charge of so much in the kingdom. You had no idea. Your entire earth life was a test every minute of every day. And I was always in your corner going, turn to me, turn to me, trust me, trust me. Trust me when the doctors say it's not going to work out. Trust me when the tax collectors say you're broke and you're never going to have anything. Trust me when they kick you out of school and say you'll never come back to this university. You blew your chance. Trust me. When you get fired, trust me. When that spouse leaves you alone and you don't even have an income, trust me. 
Trust me when the family turns against you and writes you off as a lunatic because you trust in the anointing. Trust me at all times. The Lord says you will have the reward of rewards. By placing their faith in me, they will receive the total forgiveness of sins and be made holy, taking hold of the inheritance that I give to my children.